You may or may not know that Klaviyo has released a direct integration with Canva. So before you had to export it and then import it, now the two are seamlessly linking together. So I'm going to walk you through how to install it and how to use it and go through all the steps so that way you can reduce the steps it takes to get your designs into Klaviyo. So I have here a sample template that we're going to work with and we have in here a GIF, but we have a new GIF that we want to place into this design. So let's go ahead and get started on the process of integrating the two. Now, I hope that they maybe make this a bit more easier to find, but right now we're going to go into our actual front end of our Klaviyo. And then down here at the bottom, we're going to go to integrations here in integrations. We're going to go to the directory. And then here is where we will type in Canva. So let's go ahead and click that. And then up here at the top, install. It's then going to open up your entire Canva here. And you're going to go ahead and say use in an existing design or a new design. But we already have a design that we want to get imported over. So we're going to go to use in an existing design. This is where I am going to search my projects because I have a great sample one that I want to do. And we now have it open here. This is where it'll open up a new little tab. And then that is where you'll see Klaviyo kind of appear in your uh, selections on the left. So we're going to click connect. Then it's going to drop down uh, accounts that you have. You're going to select the one that you want to link together, which is going to be your main account and click allow. So we now have our design here. So what I'm looking to do is to get this main image imported over into Klaviyo. I'm going to rename it just so I can know which one it is box image and we're going to go to start export. Now this is where we can go ahead and create our GIF or you can export just the one, but I am going to do a GIF for this one just to make it a little bit more complex. So we're going to go ahead and drop this down to a GIF. And then for my pages, I have my GIF here that I want to do. Now I need to come over to my duration. I just want to make sure that I have my timing the way I want it. And we'll see if the sizing works. So if you've ever done a GIF over into Klaviyo, you know sizing is a huge thing with limits on the actual file size. So we'll see if this will work. Sometimes we're going to have to maybe kind of mess with it. But we're going to do these slides of this lady kind of peeking up her head. And we'll click export. And voila, one and two and three, our design is now getting ready to be sent over into our Klaviyo account. Now it's up to you <laughs> if you want to kind of have this app and this step in the process, but I think it's super handy, especially if you have multiple versions that you just want to get over and you can have it for future use. If you're part of a team and you're designing here and you just want to have it for your email marketing person, upload it into Klaviyo. That kind of makes the process super clean. Okay, so it says our design was successfully exported. Let's head over into our design here. Um, I'm just going to refresh this just so I can make sure my everything is up to date. And then we're going to go into replace and voila, we have our GIF ready to be imported. How cool is that? Right? So we're going to click select and voila, our image is there as we wanted it, which is awesome. So super, super easy. I love it. Um, let's go ahead and do another sample one just in case. Let's see, what else do I have in here? So maybe we have a few product images. So with this one, I have a few different gift box sets. So let's say that we want to export several pages. That'll be a fun one to do. Let's try that. So we're going to do um, product image here, start an export. And then again, let's select the pages that we want and Ideally, it should break out each of these pages into what we want. So we have the pages that we've selected. Let's go ahead and start an export and we'll see. I'm curious with selecting multiple images, if it names each one, are they all named BFC and product image? Let's take a look. So let's say down here, we want to replace these. Perfect. So it broke it out into product image one, two and three and four. So let's say we're adding these guys in placing them in copy copy i mean it just kind of streamlines the process right especially if you have multiple people on your team i think this just makes the process a little bit cleaner here so we have our little gift sets our gift that we wanted easy as that so if you haven't set up your canva integration into klaviyo highly recommend it 
I'm going to be using it when I need to kind of get a little headline done, a GIF done. I think that's going to be the best part, being able to export the GIF over super easily. Um, hopefully this was super helpful on a tutorial on how to set this up. And uh, happy designing, guys. I'll see you in the inbox.